Yo, 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 hey man, listen, yeah. man, Longview, Texas, I'm in the building, man. Stand up, man, ID 300, Crowns 12, it. it's going down. We out here at Frenchies, man. a struggle but my favorite class was choir class and uh miss richardson uh would you come on up here miss mcclellan this was my favorite teacher right here who taught me scale and, and trained my my lovely voice and made it to where i could be what i am today thank you i love you <laughs> oh my god yeah yes you can this guy on Every contest I entered in. Uh -huh. <laughs> well, first, thank first thank everyone for coming out and celebrating this moment right here. It was a big honor for me to be able to come down here and do this with Al because he told me that he wanted to show appreciation to his community. So I want to first give everyone in attendance a round of applause just for the support. Too often, the only time we see a lot of young black men get together is when one of us is in trouble, dead, or something along those lines. I'm an individual, I have a movement called Big Reform. We travel the country going inside a prison institution, bringing about dramatic change, dramatic impact. Teaching. We don't realize just how many people we're reaching, and once they leave the classroom, they go to the class of life. And while you teach them the ABCs, what you have taught them through that day helps most of them get through at night. See, I remember when teachers had me, and my mama was no teacher, so the teachers was all I had. I did a lot of things, I've been a lot of places, I've traveled and did a lot of things, supernatural, superficial, all kind of stuff. And this, and being here, and being able to work with these people, being able to partner up and start a business here in our hometown with my sisters, is something... <clears throat> <laughs> just being able to do it is just something I can't even put into words. Already. So, this right here, it means the world. Now what's your name, brother? Clint Ingram. Clint Ingram. Yes, sir. And you, you did your restaurant. Yeah. And you used to play professional ball. Yes, sir. For who? Uh, for Jacksonville Jaguars and New Orleans. Jaguars, Orleans. man. New Orleans. Hey, hey check it, man. Hey, man, listen. Boss talk. Aldi 300. As usual, I showed up. He, I don't know if he's hiding or what. He done put his hoodie on. I guess I need to put mine on too. I don't know what he's thinking. He's not going to out hoodie me. He's not going to out hoodie me. <laughs> they showed up. He brought the city out. It was the, it was the real movement in the city that came down. The policy makers, the educators, the first responders. The crime club has done real well. And just to have my family right. 